morning. We are gonna do my workout routine today and we are um, going to F45 this morning. F45, the beaches. Morning. Morning, Jackson. Uh, good morning. <laughs> We just got done with our F45 workout. That has been something that I have added into my routine and it's very hard as you saw, like look how red my face is. It's very difficult. This video is actually sponsored by Lululemon. I'm wearing a Lululemon set. This is their sports where I'll have everything linked down below. And then the pants that you saw me wearing in the clips before are also Lululemon. They're like some of my favorite pants. I think I've like talked about Lululemon so before. I really like their um, workout clothes, like they're the best. And coincidentally, I'm reading Chip Wilson's book called Little Black Stretchy Pants and it's about how we started Lululemon and it's really interesting. But Lululemon came out with like a self-care kit, which is great. They have some really nice products in here and it's designed to just like throw this into your bag and go to the gym. Um, I usually, cause we do the 9.30 class, ends at like 10.15 and then we usually have to like get going, which is kind of disgusting cause like I'm very disgusting as you can see. Dry shampoo is like the number one thing that I need in my life after workout. This is the no-show dry shampoo. Sorry, <laughs> there's no airflow in here. <laughs> Sasha's here. <laughs> I put this in a bit before my workout as well, but like, I'm pretty sweaty, but I just do that to kind of just mask sweat. You can, I usually do this like before my workout or before I go to bed is dry shampoo, but like you know, also after to just refresh. And then I wipe my face off after the gym just cause I'm super sweaty. And then they have this face reset moisturizer. So I just like to put a moisturizer on after I wipe my face down cause my face is, I have really dry skin. It's very cooling, which I like. And as you can see, my face is extremely red after the gym. Oh, I really like this. It's just like really easy. It absorbs really quickly. And then deodorant, anti-stink deodorant. It's a spray one, which is nice. Sorry, so much aerosol in the car. And now I'm ready. They also have a lip balm, which um, I put on before I worked out. My lips are still moisturized, so it's good. But I really like this little self-care kit because you can just like throw it in your bag. Um, I also always forget to bring a bag to F45, so I just pretty much just bring this and then throw my car keys in here. It's great. So, check this out. Everything will be like, do you need the aerosol <laughs> under the windows? Check this out. You want to, there's a lot of great little items for post gym. We are gonna go get a coffee. And then when I get home, I'm gonna sit down and talk to you about my full workout routine. Okay, so home and showered. And I wanted to kind of run through my workout routine with you. I also asked some questions on Instagram. And if you aren't following me on Instagram, my Instagram is at Allegra Shaw. I post a lot of, recently I've been posting a lot more like stories about like what I'm doing in real time. I post a lot of outfits. It's kind of like, it's kind of what I post. So I asked what you guys wanted to see. Sorry, Instagram just keeps changing and I don't know how to use it anymore. Sorry, I just have to sift through all the questions that my friends sent in. The first question is, um, when did I start working out? And I started working out when I was in first year university. So that's a long time ago. I was like 18, I'm 26 now. So long time. Um, and I just started going to the gym. The next question is how often do I work out? I work out three to five times a week, really just depends on my schedule. And the three kind of like workouts that I like doing are, um, I just showed you, I started doing F45 and I find it, it's an incredible workout. Monday, Wednesday, Fridays are cardio. And then Tuesdays and Thursdays are like weight and resistance training. I've really enjoyed the workouts. I, they really push you. Um, they're really difficult and it's kind of like a new workout for me. I definitely like feel it. 
and I've been having a lot of fun. So I go to the one in the beach and it's great. The next thing I do is Pilates um, and I do Bailey Brown workouts at home. This is something I've been doing for a while. It's also great because I can do them at home and they can be like really quick. Definitely like more uh, just like body weight uh, long lean muscles, a lot of like stretching and that stuff, um, which I find really nice. That's definitely a workout I do when I'm short on time or um, I'm traveling. And then my classic is I do go to the gym and I do like lift heavy weights at the gym. I usually focus right now, I'm focusing my gym workouts just on my glutes because I feel like I get a really great upper body workout at F45. So I just, when I go to the gym, I do glute exercises. I do have some videos on my channel of my glute exercises. I mean, I don't think I have like the best form in the world. I'm not like a personal trainer or anything, but um, consult a personal trainer or consult, you know, like someone who's a professional before doing anything. Um, I'm not a pro. Next question that I saw a lot was about like supplements and eating. So I don't take any like workout supplements. After the gym, I usually have a like either a protein smoothie. So like I just make a smoothie with protein powder. Uh, my favorite protein powder, I like the Vega one and I like the Thorn one, kind of it. So I'm just all a protein bar. And then my diet, uh, I don't really have a diet. I don't eat dairy while I am here. Sometimes I'm, I dabble when I'm in Europe because um, it doesn't actually hurt my stomach or break me out in Europe. But for when I'm in North America, Canada, I don't eat dairy at all. Other than that, I kind of intuitively eat. I don't restrict myself. I eat kind of what I want to eat and I just like don't binge eat. I try to eat healthy foods uh, and I try to eat foods that I know are good for me and that make me feel good. A lot of questions about like finding time to go to the gym and staying motivated. I totally get this. It can be di very difficult to stay motivated. I stay motivated, it just working out makes me feel really good i mean like not while i'm doing it and like not right after for me but like if i don't work out i feel down i feel gross i feel like heavy and i really don't like that so that's kind of what keeps me motivated to go it can be really difficult especially at the beginning to go um i feel like the first like week that you start working out you're like really motivated and you want to go and then that's after that kind of like you're like oh, i don't really want to go anymore try to find the most optimal time for you to work out for me like i don't work out at night because um i just i never end up going if i commit to going at night i work in the morning and that's what that's just like what works for me I used to work out at night and then it changed because I got so busy that by the end of the day, I'm really exhausted and I don't wanna work out. So, you know, just go with whatever works for you. Someone asked for like finding time when you're really busy. It can be really difficult, but like my mentality is like, I just need to get something in, you know? Like I just need to do that 15 minutes, that 20 minutes, and I just need to do some a little bit of something every day. Find a class or find something that like is fun and find it at a time that like just works best for your schedule so you kind of like want to go. The hardest part about going to the gym for me is like getting my workout clothes on and going to the gym. Once I'm there, it's fine, but it's like that getting there. When I was just like working out in the gym, I would do two days a week glutes and then I would do cardio and abs day and then I would do an upper body day. Any tips for building a workout routine or schedule? I think like consulting someone who is good at it um, and getting someone to write something out for you or like working on figuring out what works for you. But again, I did two days a week glutes, one day a week upper body, and then one day a week cardio and abs when I was working out in the gym. Now I do like F4, because I'm like not home a lot, it's kind of harder to do a schedule, but I'll do F45, um, like three days. I'll do workout in the gym like one or two days. And then one of those is usually like dropped and I'll do something at home or I'll just skip the at home. Like it, my, I don't really have a schedule right now. It's just like whatever I can do. Am I sore after working out? When I work out hard, yep, of course I'm sore. Mm, my focus is definitely to like look and feel my best. Another question I got a lot was about calories. I just don't count calories. I don't look at that at all. Like I don't even know really how to go about that. So yeah. I also want you to just remember that every body is different and like I'm naturally pretty slim. My mom is slim and um, I don't have like big hips. I don't have big boobs. I'm like, pretty small. So when I do gain weight, I gain it in my face and I gain it in like my like legs and midsection. A couple years ago, I gained like 10 to 15 pounds and like that's kind of where I gained it. Um, I was just like a bit thicker in the waist and my butt got pretty big. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's it. 
I have a beginner's guide to the gym video if you want to look at that. I still stand by like a lot of those things that I say, like how to get into the gym. I'll link it down below. It's a great video. So yeah, that's it. Thank you so much to Lululemon for sponsoring this video. Um, my Honestly, my favorite workout clothes are Lululemon. I am obsessed with my Lululemon leggings. I think I have five pairs of Lululemon leggings. Like they are just my favorite. They're the most high-waisted. They're the most comfortable for me. And I absolutely love them. And I think it's really cool that they came out with all these self-care products. These are the big ones. They actually have full size of all the products as well if you want to do that instead of the travel size. Um, you can you can check out the outfit that I wore um, and then all the pro the products down below. I think it's really cool they sponsor this video because it's such it's a brand that like I love and I've loved for so long. I remember buying my first Lululemon product and it was a sweatshirt and it was like $100 and I was in grade seven and it was so expensive and I wore it every day. And then I bought Lululemon pants and yeah. So I just am really, it's really cool. So definitely check those out. They're great after workout um, products that you can kind of just like throw in your bag, put them on and like go to your meeting or whatever. Uh, if you have any other questions about working out or health, you can leave them down below and I can do a follow-up video. Remember to follow me on Instagram. Love you all. Peace and love.